Hey guys, Yu Shang here. Welcome to another StarCraft 2 lesson in two minutes. In this video, we're going to be looking at how to do control groups. So, super basic for some of you guys, but really, really important. Probably the most important thing you're going to want to learn as a beginner. So, let's run through this real quick. Um, okay, why do we want control groups? So, the main reason we want control groups is because without them, you're going to have to play mostly with your mouse. Like, for example, if you want to make some workers, you're going to have to click on your hatchery. Um, you could press S, but I see a lot of people even clicking on that. And then you could press D for drones. But again, I see a lot of people clicking to make the drones. And then you're going to have to go to your, another, uh, your next base and do the same thing. And so basically the problem is that it's just really, really slow. And once you get to, you know, two bases even, or three bases, four bases, five, you're really going to start to struggle. So that's why we want to make control groups. Uh, so let's learn how to do it. So basically there's two main methods you want to learn as a beginner. There is control plus number. Number being just like any number obviously that you can set these to. And shift plus number. So they do slightly different things, but yeah, you're going to want to learn both. Okay, let's set our hatcheries to a control group. So what you want to do, come to any of your hatcheries, click on it, and then we're going to start with control plus number. So control, let's do number four. So control four. I would advise you to also pick four. I think that's the best key for hatcheries. So as you can see down here, we have all our control groups. Um, a lot of them are hidden. You have from one to zero and four has popped up. It's a hatchery. You can see it by the little picture and there's a number one beside it. So obviously it's a hatchery key. The number one is how many hatcheries are on there. So currently we only have one hatchery on here. But we can actually set up both hatcheries on this key as well. So if you want to click on your second hatchery, this time we're going to press Shift 4. So no longer pressing Control 4, we're going to go Shift 4. And now you might be wondering, why did we do uh, Control 4 on the first one and Shift 4 on the second one? And the reason is because they, the Control 1 creates a new key and the Shift 1 adds to an existing key. All right, so basically if you want to make a new key, like if we wanted to make um, this first hatchery its own key again, we could press control four. But the problem is that'll actually remove the other one because it's creating a brand new control group, right? So whenever you want to add to a key, use shift. So here we'll do shift four. Whenever you want to make a new one, control four. And I think that's pretty much all you need to know. So you can play around with this. We could put our Zerglings on a key. Let's do number one. We could, I don't know, put our Scouting Overlord on a key as well. Let's do number three. So control three. And bam, you're good to go. Maybe next time you make a new hatchery, go over here. And as soon as the new hatchery is started, you can add that to your hatchery key with shift four. So I think you guys get the basics. There is definitely more to learn here. Um, but this should get you going on the right track, get you set up with control groups, have you stop playing with your mouse so much, and yeah, get you climbing up the ladder quickly. So I think that's it for this guide. Go check out my other ones. I will see you in a bit.